Welcome back, back TJ. TJ. It's Eddie. And Grace. We're your main anchors for the week. Hey Eddie, I'm kind of craving a burrito bowl. Well, then you're in luck. Girls Swim and Dive is having a Chipotle fundraiser next week. I heard the fundraiser will be held at the Chipotle on Hamden on Tuesday, January 28th from 5 to 9 p.m. As long as you mention TJ Girls Swim and Dive, 33% of the money you will spend will be donated to the team. Speaking of sports, they're in the studio. Let's see what they have to say. Hey TJ. It's Pinky. And the Brain. Last Saturday, girls varsity basketball had a game against Centaurs. Unfortunately, the girls lost. We'll get them next time. Also on Saturday, girls wrestling had a meet at Pooter. Boys wrestling also had a meet on Saturday at Kennedy. Tonight, girls swim has a varsity meet against Hinkley at TJ. The meet starts at 4.15. Be there, TJ. There will also be another girls swim meet this Wednesday. And finally, uh, JRTC had a regionals drill meet in Texas last Thursday. That's it for us. It's Pinky. And the Brain. Hey TJ, we had a game on Saturday. We played against Centaurus. Um, unfortunately, we lost, but we have a game tomorrow that we're going to catch a dub in. Hey guys, it's Laura. And Abby from the girls swim team. We have a meet today against Hinkley High School here at TJ at 4.30, so be sure to support. Tomorrow we have a fundraiser at Chipotle on Hampton. It's going to be from 5 to 9, so go out and support us. And then on Wednesday, we have a home meet here at TJ, and it's our senior night, so make sure you come out. We also are ranked 11th in the state right now for 3A, so just be A. <laughs> Lydia from JRTC. Last week we went down to Texas for regionals and we got first in regulation and fourth in exhibition and now we're going to be going to Virginia in March so wish us luck. Then we went down to Texas and we competed in the regionals and, and we placed first in regulation, we placed fourth in exhibition and we placed ninth overall over all the 26 teams um, and we are very excited and we're happy to say that we are going to go to nationals to Virginia so wish us luck. Speaking of useful information, DEC is in the house. So is NHS. Let's send it to them. What up TJ, it's Connor from DECA. So our chapter meeting is coming up this Thursday, the 30th. It's gonna be in room 111. Uh, if you wear your chapter t-shirt, you get free food. Uh, we're gonna have giveaways and just discuss what's on the agenda this semester for DECA. So see you there. Hey guys, it's Farine from N NHS. We have a meeting Tuesday, January 28th in Miss Starbucks room. If you have a GPA of 3.5 or higher, come join us. Thanks, NHS. Speaking of honors, Grace, are your grades good enough to join? Of course they are. Speaking of school, let's send it to the people who run it. Good morning, TJ. Mr. Kristoff here, your favorite principal. Hey, guys, a couple things I want to remind you of. Keep doing a good job in the lobby and in the cafeteria of throwing all your garbage away in the morning and during lunchtime. Keep that area as clean as you possibly can. Pick up after yourselves. Pick up after your friends. Um, and then another thing is we're going to be on the news this week a couple different spots. So keep your eyes peeled. We'll make some more announcements when those times, uh, when we know when that's going to happen. But um, it's put some pretty good publicity for the school, and it's really just showcasing everything cool that you guys are doing here at school. All right, thanks, TJ. Have a great week. Christoph out. Good morning, Spartans. Happy Monday. Hey, so it's gold out Friday. Remember, get some gear. Have a great week. Happy Monday, TJ. Juniors, those of you fantastic students that signed up for SAT prep, there will be a meeting this Wednesday, the beginning of office hours, in room 111, the community room. It's going to be real quick. Make sure you get there. Um, Wednesday, room 111, office hours, SAT prep, for those of you that signed up. Thanks, TJ. Thanks, Admin. I hear there are some interesting things going on in the world. News will tell us all about what's going on. Hey TJ, it's Hunter. And Z Money. And we're here to bring you the news. Unfortunately, yesterday morning, Kobe Bryant and his daughter passed in a helicopter crash. There were seven others that perished in the crash as well. This shows how we shouldn't take life for granted. Sending love to the families. In lighter news, the Grammys 2020 also took place yesterday night. Billie Eilish blew away. She blew. She won she four Grammys for Best New Artist, Song, Record, and Album of the Year. That's awesome. That's all we have for you today. See you all tomorrow, TJ. Good morning, TJ. Miss Cotton's here. Um, next week is Counselor Appreciation Week, so I'm working on a little project for all of our counselors. So if you would like to come by um, today at the start of lunch, so right at 1120, and help me do something for your counselor, I'd greatly appreciate it. Thanks so much. Have a great day. 
Thanks, News. I feel enlightened. That's all we have for today, TJ. See you tomorrow. Peace, Peace out. out. Favorite childhood memory. Uh, I remember riding down like a crazy hill in New York City on my big wheel, um, and like flipping over like five times, and then I got up, you know, dust myself off, went in the house, and realized that I had gashed my head open. Favorite type of dinosaur? It's got to be a. It's got to be a Triceratops. Mr. Jackson. Between T Rex and Mr. Jackson, toss it. Wow. Most memorable moment. Um, <laughs> yeah, uh, the birth of my first child. It's pretty memorable. I am. I am. Uh, I guess I would be a Gen. No, I'm Gen X. Yeah, I'm Gen X. A boomer. Then I have to go with. That's a boomer right there. Happy belated birthday, you bald headed man. Happy belated birthday, Mr. Jackson. The go. Today's word is outlandish, spelled O U T L A N D I S H. Is that a chair in a tree? How outlandish. <laughs> now that's outlandish. Alright, do you pour, which one do you pour first, milk or cereal? Uh, cereal. Yeah. Cereal. Pour my cereal first, and then my milk. I'd rather have my cereal not soggy when I have it inside the bowl, so. Cereal? Yeah, same. <laughs> cereal, because if you pour your milk first, you're a psychopath. Your cereal. My cereal. Uh, I pour, uh, uh, I pour uh, cereal and pour milk. <laughs> Cereal goes first. Go. Eat, Eat it up, up TJ. TJ. You.